Filming live from a third-story, one-bedroom apartment in North Mishawaki, Indiana, it's the Handlebar Growing Mustache Extravaganza with your host, Dave. Handlebar Mustache Show, Handlebar Mustache Show. Mustache is looking great, but we can't be late for the Handlebar Mustache Show. Welcome back to year three, day 50, take two, championship styles, day three. Well, another long week. I'm going to get my oil changed and 50-point inspection on Monday, so that'll be nice. I got some news. My aunt broke her elbow. I guess she fell. She's getting that age, I guess, in their 50s. Usually they're older than that. Hmm. Maybe there's something in the water. I don't know, but I'm glad my elbows are free. Free to point to myself with my thumbs, anyway. So I got that going for me, so... We were talking about the Mustache Grower's Guide, and we're almost to the end of the book. I know you're sad. Not as sad as me, though. So we did the championship styles. We had the strong man and the special delivery. The guy who was a mailman. Oh, look at that. The laser loop. That guy's got double twisted style. What does this say? It says... Sam Holcomb clearly remembers the last day he shaved his stash. May 2nd, 2007. That year he was set on competing in the World Beard and Mustache Competition in London. But the feeling that his mustache wasn't quite ready kept him home in Jacksonville, Florida. So when the 2009 competition rolled around, this time in Anchorage, Alaska, the cook from the Sunshine State was ready. Along with his twin brother, Devin, he set a northern course and ventured... At, and returned a third place winner in the English mustache category. While the English is one of Holcomb's favorites, he's no stranger to more experimental styles, like the loopy intervention inspired by the roller coaster of that name, which Sam recalls from his childhood. So it says this one's got a difficulty of four. Ah, a mustache says a lot. A mustache says that you like a lot of attention. If you're a shy person, it's probably not the best thing to have. Ah, oh, lucky for me, I'm not shy. Actually, sometimes I'm shy with people I don't know, because I can come on a bit strong sometimes. So I'll be quiet at some points until I get to know them. And then, oh, it's stream close-up, looking nice. All right, guys, well, it's been a long week. I'm about to watch Saturday Night Live. So, hmm... Knock on wood. Keep it classy, you know him. And until I see you Monday, I bid you all arrivederci. And adieu. Whew. I tell you, sometimes work is exhausting.